Johnny Palmer. I'm the founder of Pitch, and I'm the guy that's behind the Pitch Air project. Basically, us getting this airplane to Bristol so we can use it as an office. As a kid, I always thought, yeah, I want to have one of those private jets. I'd be cool, I'd love that. And I think that when you get this idea in your head, those things often happen, but not as I thought. I got interested in sustainability and reducing carbon and stuff and realized that flying around in private aircraft is just absurd, but I still love airplanes. So I ended up buying, buying this thing, which doesn't fly, but is the ultimate in terms of private jets. So the stage we're at with this project is we've gone through getting planning commission, um, done the deal on the aircraft, bought the aircraft, I've got the transport organized, closures and police escort sort of for tomorrow. So now it all just has to come together and that thing be in Bristol by tomorrow lunchtime. No, not at all. It'll be fun. And even if it goes wrong, that'll be fun, yeah? I think he's going to be really excited, even though we had to wake up in like six in the morning. My name's Pete Stone. I'm a Rhodes Police and Officer. This is one of many that we've done running out of Kemble. Obviously, Kemble Airport, they get dismantled aircraft and they sell the fuselages all around the world, so it's quite often we get called upon to come and shut the roads for public safety. I've never seen an aircraft transported before, so we just watch them coming into Kemble, but never seen one leaving on the back of a trailer. So we're pulled over on the side of the M5 now because um, the police in Bristol had a different route from the one that we're actually working to, so I'm hoping that they can find a resolution to this. Part of the live streamed event we've been doing online during the transport, we've been raising money for the Great Western Air Ambulance, and as part of their training operations, they managed to get their helicopter up in the air while we were driving pitch air down the motorway. We're here today for a Sparrow Crane Iron. We're doing a lift, and this is my partner here in Troy. Right now we're just getting the cranes into place. This is the first one, which I believe is 200 tons. That's going to get to the bottom of the yard. Then the airplane's going to come back into the yard. And the second crane's going to come in so they can get it from either end and raise it up and onto the containers. They've done a really good job of getting it here, and it's going to look amazing because this is going to be an attraction. It's so exciting. The buzz is just amazing. Are you excited to see the plane? Yeah, I was really excited. What did it look like inside? It looked like a What's this for? For like a parking ticket? or no, it's obstruction. Obstruction. Don't remove the vehicle. Mm. We'll have to remove it for you. <laughs> <laughs> It's been a mental weekend. Lots of stuff has gone wrong. We've resolved it. Hard work by everyone. And finally, we've got it. Super happy about this. Job done.